my friends, and welcome back to our channel. It's been a little over a year since we first started this channel as a means for providing engineering undergraduate uh, course content for my students um, as a result of the, the COVID pandemic. And so we've now gone a little over a year. We have a, almost 160 videos at the time of this recording. And I just wanted to take a second to say how much I appreciate everybody that stopped by and the comments and the feedback that we've gotten, whether it's through the through the forums on YouTube or whether it's, you know, other direct means. I appreciate what you've done. And so I've decided that you know, I want to continue to develop this even though our classes are soon going back to normal. Um, there are some things that I want to try doing maybe a little bit differently and I'm just looking for some ideas or some thoughts from you all and the, those of you that have chosen to subscribe and to follow that are along that front. Um, the first idea is that obviously I want to continue to add content. Um, what we provided is some basic undergraduate information for, um, again, a typical bachelor's level degree in the U.S. Um, for civil engineering and well, really any engineering, but definitely a civil focus because that's what I am. I'm a civil engineer. And so we've done courses on statics. We've done structural analysis, steel design, concrete design, um, applied engineering mathematics, just to name a few, and then some other miscellaneous topics that have popped up in other classes or other discussions I've had. Uh, through my students um, with those, but and it's, it's interesting looking at the analytics and seeing what's tending to be the most popular video it isn't what I thought it would be, and so it kind of got me to thinking that some of those you know quicker topics that are a little bit more in depth but um, or covered in a kind of a much shallower basis is maybe where we need to be going now that we've got most of the course content up. Now I will continue to update courses and add you know add information to say our concrete series or to our steel design series or even our applied math series as you know, as the need arises just to kind of keep updating i will also i promise be redoing a lot of the videos because if you were here at the very beginning you saw that the video quality was less than stellar and that was because we were in a moment of crisis and it was a matter of let's get the content up and get it out so that the students can keep keep taking their classes and obviously hopefully you've seen in some of the series especially in, in more recent months that the quality you know whether it's the lighting or the video or the audio has hopefully improved dramatically now for some of the series say like the steel design series that started in the middle and is now looped back around the first videos are probably a whole lot better than the later ones because the later videos were indeed the, the first ones that were made and so I do apologize for that and we will work to kind of rectify that and, and improve the graphics and hopefully but I think the content is still valid so so I, I appreciate everything and um, all the feedback and the comments that you guys have given me over this last year and I'm looking forward to doing some exciting things moving forward now obviously I make a lot of hand gestures and I bob my head a lot that's why I don't usually put myself on camera but I thought for this one I'll let you guys see who I am and and, and we'll go from there. Now, one of the things that I want to work on going forward is, you know, as we said, I want to add to our existing content, but I'm also toying with the idea of doing some things that are a little bit maybe out of my comfort zone. Um, I'm, I would like to do kind of like an interactive programming kind of kind of kind of project where I, you know, we, we talk about you know things like C Sharp or WPF or or even C plus plus and how we can apply that to engineering. Um, applications that you know an undergraduate or even a graduate student might be interested in and of course maybe the professionals might find something useful out of it too just kind of depends on how it grows and I've got some ideas on some projects that I would like to kind of work on and share with you guys as far as that goes so that's one thing I'd like to do I'd also like to kind of toy with the idea of maybe doing some interactive you know help session -y kind of stuff where maybe we can set up some times you know during during the week and you know we, we do like a like a live episode and you guys can kind of rattle off some problems to me or something and I can kind of give you some guidance now I'm not going to work your homework for you but you know maybe I can help you get over that the, the, the stumbling block on where you're at and we'll, we'll work on how, how do we deliver that because there's some technical challenges with how do I get that information from you without violating copyright laws and that kind of stuff are all things that we want to kind of kind of be careful of and steer, steer clear of obviously um we're working on setting up a Discord channel, so we can do that. We may be doing some things on Twitch. Um, just kind of, again, we're just trying some new things. A, a year ago, if you would have asked me if I had been, done anything like this before, I would say absolutely not. I've never used a webcam. I've never played with audio recording software. I'm now fairly proficient with OBS. You know, there's a lot of stuff that I've learned that, you know, out of, you know, out of hard times, sometimes comes opportunities. And I would like to kind of try to see if I can develop that and to further grow this channel. So if you've got any suggestions or want to see anything in particular, talk to me. Leave me some comments down below on this video. I'll put this as the kind of the welcome to the channel video for now, just so you guys can, um, you know, have a, have a means to interact with me. And so I appreciate everybody that's stuck around for all this time. I know it's a lot of videos. I try to keep them somewhat condensed, somewhat interesting, not just a straight, direct lecture presentation type. 
for for the channel content but that's what it is so anyway thank you very much and we will see you guys next time